I lost the wall mover. What, what did you and the dog do this weekend? Yeah. Oh, I lost the. Hold on. I got to upload the video file here. This Give me a good. second. This is good stuff. It was, um, this is excellent stuff. Is it excellent stuff? I love I it. Dude. I love it. it I, I, I don't know. I, <laughs> it, it was so. Here's the backstory. Um, last minute, like a week or two ago, I got a call from our public information officer and said, Hey, you ever heard of Mutz to Models? I said, No idea what that means. And she said, There's Gala. Oh my God, I could say so. The Mercedes Benz. You'll like this, Wombat. At the Mercedes Benz dealership. And it's to benefit uh, this uh, Marty Paws, uh, Scott's Wish. Like there's all these charities that it benefits. Yeah, yeah. And uh, canines that come back from deployment that don't have care, they get money to them. Like there's a whole bunch of stuff that it does. Sure, sure. Um, but she goes, Do you want to bring Luna? And I'm like, Well, she's a community relations dog. That's our whole job with the sheriff's office. She's a comfort canine. We go do the stuff that the real canines don't want to do because you don't want to bring a bite dog to something like this. So we go and... No, they want to you know, rip we, your we, face off. That's yeah, their job. We, we, we are the kinder, gentler version of this. And I said, well, you're going to be walking the runway. And I said, we're going to do what now? <laughs> and she said, no, you're going to walk the r- runway. And I'm like, well, that sounds interesting. And so they... Uh, I looked and at the apps. Just yeah, and I was going to say, did you ask <laughs> if you were the my G suit with model? nothing under it? <laughs> um, so Lolo Jones was hosting, and I was like, well, <laughs> Luna needs a mom. But <laughs> what you soon find out, though, is that when you show up to any of these events in uniform, you're not showing up like Wombat with his Porsche, you're showing up as a man in uniform, which means all the rich people just look right through you. Like you are the yes. help. Just stay right. out of sight. Yeah. In fact, when I showed up to introduce myself and say, Hey, we brought Luna. She's like, well, I don't need security right now. I'm like, what, what do you, what do you mean? She's like, you're with the detail, right? You're part of the detail, the security. I'm like, That's no ma'am, you're like, we're good, supposed you're not to be <laughs> walking. You know, we're in the first group. They're like, you're not on the list. I'm like, well, that's cool. They're like, no, 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 yeah, wait, here you are. You're the right end right here. So they moved us all the way dead last. <laughs> so it was supposed to be like a 10 minute in out, you're done. It ended up being like a two hour ordeal, Dude, which was fun. I, Luna was great. Dude, there were there was a million dollars worth of cars between three cars in the parking lot. They had a Maybach with a V12 and some other cars. Anyway, all right, here's the here's the video. I'll stop. I it's cool. It's cool. You ready? And here is now Deputy the Lord is the witness. I love Luna's personality. Oh, yeah. Like, I got this. I got this. <laughs> you're more nervous than she is. Oh, hands uh, down. My... <laughs> so my goal in all this, because I, you just never know with dogs. You never know. My goal was, number one, not get lost. Because as you can see your, here. I know what your goal was. It's, I it's totally not, don't. It's not easy. Somebody went the wrong way. Like three or four people turned right instead of left. So my goal was to, number one, not get lost. And number two, when Luna got to the end, one dog tried to jump off. So I was making sure she didn't do that. And then... Don't trip. Uh, number three, not not face plant myself with Luna, you know, and her start to just try to pull somewhere or do something. And so I just wanted to look like we were a professional oh. team. Good, That's dude. it. That was my whole goal was to look like we knew what we were doing and that we were a trained team. So yeah. that was it. It's you know what it reminds me. It reminded me of uh, you guys have done flyovers, right? Oh, and yeah. you know what they say: the best you can do is break even. Oh, yeah. The absolute best you can do. You don't because they're like, well, how come you didn't do a loop to a barrel roll and, and stuff? It's like because I don't want to lose <laughs> my entire wings <laughs> right. and career. And everything. Now, granted, that'll happen later in life. Mm-hmm. But you don't want to lose it right then and there when all you need to do is walk a straight line, turn around and walk a straight line back. That's your whole job in this thing and flying over a stadium, whatever. You have one purpose. Look professional. <laughs> don't do anything stupid. Oh, yeah. And, and that's that's my whole goal. You know, that was it. Although. You did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you could have spun, like you could have done a little spin. <laughs> no, that would have nice. that would have wound up with me breaking my neck, falling the off the stage. No, they don't, just they don't I just well. I feel like if we'd have done that, you don't want to go viral. 
You don't. You don't, don't want to go. I mean, isn't no, that why we're all no. here? <laughs> we want to go viral because of the <laughs> intelligent things we say on this podcast. We don't want to go viral because of. Hold on, that was never written to me in the mission statement. <laughs> well, he's once trying to say we don't, we don't want like we don't want to go like cancel uh, <laughs> viral. Oh, we'll get there at the end. We got we the cancel. We're already get canceled I mean, by the end of the night. Don't worry. 